Um, it's the retro future. Do I? Yeah? Yeah, yeah. See you guys later. Bye. Do I? Are you a YouTuber? Yes, I am. And I'm getting mighty tired of your traveling ways and of listening to that jackass Bray. I am out in a place called Mallorca. Now this exact place that I'm in is called Parma and I'm here for a kind of like a family uh, reunion type of thing. It's a party for my uncle and my half brother. For the first night that I'm here, I've just been staying in this hotel. It's called the Inside Hotel with like two ends. I thought I'd do a little bit of a tour. You're probably never gonna see me in a hotel again in these videos, so I thought I might as well uh, show you guys. We'll start off with the bathroom. This is it here, it's a... Uh, it's been used, I've just had myself a shower. Nice little joint, to be honest with you. Don't know what that is, I think it's called a bidet. Literally like out here in the middle of bloody nowhere. No, no one, no one really speaks a lot of English. The whole video isn't gonna be fully that. I'm gonna try and get some like, shoe shot. I'm gonna try and get some like retro kind of base stuff in it. Yeah, I know you guys don't really, aren't overly fond of my vlogs where I'm not doing anything retro related. That's fine, that's the channel I set up to make. But I'm heading out, I'm on my own. I'm actually with my family at the moment out here, but I'm on my own right now. And I'm gonna be heading to a shop called Game, which a lot of you guys might know, but we didn't have that in Jersey. So that's what I'm gonna do. That's the first stop. If I find something retro, which is cool, I'm gonna give it away to one of you guys. Uh, and that doesn't apply just for Game, that applies for this whole time that I'm on this trip. So without any further ado, let's get to Game. How the hell do I get in? Oh, here we go. Let's see what the crack is. I can't film. Inside, no. No? Okay. Right, so I wasn't allowed to film in game, which is a bit of a uh, plan pooper. There wasn't really too much great stuff in there. I saw a, um, a SNES Mini for 79 euros. You guys have to let me know in the comments if that was a good deal or not. 79 euros is like, s probably like 65 quid, 65 pounds, which I think is actually retail price, so that's probably not bad. Oh. Speak English? Um, do you know where I'd find like a, a retro shop, like games shop, like a console game retro shop? Uh, Vintage? Because I went down to a yeah. shop called Game, yeah. and they've only got like modern stuff. I need like old, old stuff. Old, old, I don't know. Nothing like that at all. No. So I spoke to the guy in the shop, lovely guy, and he said that there's nothing really too retro related in Spain. So that is a uh, going to make things slightly difficult. But apparently there is a second-hand shop at the end of this road. Now, I've done a couple of second-hand shop videos in Jersey, and uh, you guys have said that they're quite good shots. So I'm hoping to see if this will give me a full experience of like a not-so-good shop. But if I walk in there and there's a Super Nintendo, oh. There's some Japanese games up there, which is quite cool. Older stuff. Can you can you get the um, 1080, 1080 snowboard one, yeah. please? I'd like to buy that one. Yeah, that's only only the. Um, that's great. Yeah, just the car. Yeah. Box, huh? yeah, yeah, perfect. You want? Thanks very much. 
Okay, so not actually a massive fail. I've been here for like a day or something and I found a SNES game. Cool. There's also a photo. Are you recording our store? You yeah. Can, you cannot. I just want to take some photos of some of the stuff in here. If that is okay. Cool. Can I can I have a look at some of this stuff? Like uh How much how much are these? Uh it's uh one euro, two euro, one. That is way how much is this? This is eight euros. Perfect, thank you. Merci. Great. Are these mine now? Perfect. Thanks very much. Right, well this is proving to be pretty goddamn successful. We just found some strange Game Boy Color games and a Pokemon game as well. And we've also got that SNES game. Pretty good haul so far. right down at the end of this road. It's looking uh, pretty shut. Actually, there's a sign over here. Let's see what this is. Hello. Well, here we are. I actually, I actually saw this place on Google when I was uh, having a look around to see what was out here. <gasps> oh my God. Game Boys. Had one of these as a kid as well, that's quite cool. Easy flash. Oh wow. This game's here as well. How much how much are all of these? Um 20. 20. 20 each. Okay. Can I um could I have a look at have a look at the, does this open? Can I uh It's a game gear multicar. That's insane. How much is this? Uh, so, seven. Seven euros? Yes. Uh, ten. Ten euros as well. Euros. Could I do a, a, like for two, would I be able to get, like, get two things for, for a slightly lower price? So? Um, so that game that's uh, up there, it's, it's ten euros. And this, uh -huh. is, this is seven. Would you do fifteen for both? Oh, yes. Yeah? No problem. Great. Perfect. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. That is crazy. <laughs> it's very nice. Team. Camera for the Game Boy. Okay, perfect. Wow. Thank you very much, guys. I needed help in that shop. Like I was absolutely in heaven. I picked up a couple of cool things as well. Definitely going to make some videos on it. So um, yeah, I think that shop was like super weird. It was like pitch black. None of them spoke English, obviously, but that's like Spanish uh, kind of shop. But there was so much cool stuff in there. There was like all these multi carts. Hopefully, I got some of it on on film for you guys to have a look. I picked up a um, like a really really strange NES game. Hopefully I've got enough clips to make a video of like retro shopping in Mallorca, but God damn successful. I'm so happy with this. Let me know what you guys have thought so far in the comments. Thank you. It's time to do a little haul and show you guys the stuff that I got. 
just got myself a nice Spanish beer. So I'm gonna give this a try and see what it tastes like. So this is my first ever uh, Mahu, Mahu. Got a bit of glass as well. Right, let's try this out. I'm certainly no beer connoisseur, but I definitely like, this is a big top right here. Definitely like a good beer, so it smells very beer. That is goddamn good. Right, so let me show you guys what I've bought so far. So, before we go too far, I'll show you these a little bit better. Uh, move the beer out of the way. So, the first game that I got, or one of the first ones that I got was this thing. I think it was about 10 euros, um, but I managed to get a little bit of a deal. I managed to get them down uh, for both of these things. This was originally seven euros. I got both of them for 15, so it's like some crazy unlicensed NES game, which I'm gonna try as soon as I get, I'm gonna try all these games when I get back from, uh, from Spain. My camera's about to run out of battery, so yeah, got these two right here. This one came in the box as well, so I'll show you guys that when I get back into Jersey. But this is actually the first thing I got. When I first saw this, I didn't really think I was gonna get anything else, but boy, was I wrong. So it's this, it's uh, 1080 snowboarding. And then lastly, I managed to find a couple of Game Boy games. So I got Pokemon Yellow. I think this was like nine euros or something. I got a Shrek game, 101 Dalmatians, and a skateboarding game. I didn't really look at any of this stuff. I kind of just like picked it up. They were like one euros each or something like that. So yeah, pretty good haul. Bearing in mind, all of this stuff's probably gonna be in Spanish. I'm quite excited to see what it's gonna be like when I go back to Jersey.